The Sikorsky UH-60 Black Hawk is a four-blade, twin-engine, medium-lift utility military helicopter manufactured by Sikorsky Aircraft. The UH-60 features four-blade main and tail rotors, and is powered by two General Electric T-700 turboshaft engines. The helicopter has a long, low-profile shape to meet the Army's requirement for transporting aboard a C-130 Hercules, with some disassembly. It can carry 11 troops with equipment, lift 2,600 pounds of cargo internally or 9,000 pounds of cargo externally by sling. The Black Hawk multirole helicopter serves with the U.S. military and the armed forces of 28 other countries worldwide as a tough, reliable utility helicopter. During the last 40 years, this remarkable aircraft has fought its way in and out of countless combat zones to deliver and extract troops, save lives as a medevac or casualty evacuation platform, provide critical supplies to troops, deliver emergency supplies during natural disasters, and perform as an aerial firefighter and border patroller. After entering service, the helicopter was modified for new missions and roles, including mine laying and medical evacuation. An A-60 variant was developed to conduct electronic warfare and special operations aviation developed the MH-60 variant to support its missions. The UH-60L also featured more power and lifting capability with upgraded T-700 GE, 701C engines and an improved gearbox, both from the SH-60B Seahawk. Its external lift capacity increased by 1,000 pounds up to 9,000 pounds. The UH-60L also incorporated the SH-60B's Automatic Flight Control System LFCS, for better flight control with the more powerful engines. Now the modern variant of this utility aircraft is taking on a new mission set as an armed helicopter to provide fire suppression when supporting ground troops, as well as armed escort. With digital avionics, powerful GE engines, high-strength airframe structures, and composite wide-cord rotor blades. Today's Black Hawk platform has better survivability and situational awareness, and can fly higher and carry more than its predecessors ever did. More than 4,000 Black Hawk aircraft of all types are in service worldwide today. The U.S. Army is the largest operator with 2,135H-60 designated aircraft. The same aircraft sold internationally direct from Sikorsky acquires the S-70 designation. In 1993, Black Hawks featured prominently in the Battle of Mogadishu in Somalia. Black Hawks also saw action in the Balkans and Haiti in the 1990s. U.S. Army UH-60s and other helicopters conducted many air assault and other support missions during the 2003 invasion of Iraq. The UH-60 has continued to serve in operations in Afghanistan and Iraq. Highly modified H-60s were employed during the U.S. Special Operations mission that resulted in the death of Osama bin Laden during Operation Neptune Spear on 1 May 2011. One such MH-60 helicopter crash landed during the operation and was destroyed by the team before it departed in the other MH-60 and a backup MH-47 Chinook with bin Laden's remains. Two MH-47s were used for the mission to refuel the two MH-60s and as backups. In 2022, the Royal Air Force and British Army expects to select a helicopter for the new medium helicopter program to replace several existing helicopters. Sikorsky has indicated it expects its S-70M to meet the requirement. The UH-60 comes in many variants and many different modifications. The U.S. Army variants can be fitted with the stub wings to carry additional fuel tanks or weapons. Variants may have different capabilities and equipment to fulfill different roles.